Oh, hey there, Bruce. Welcome back to Rude Letter, The Last Answer. We've finally cracked this nut here, and it is time for him to tell us exactly what he knows about Aya. Because I think that's going to be reasonably enlightening, because from the people that did know her that we've talked to, or were meant to have known her, it seems like they're hiding something pretty major. <laughs> And I want to know what. I want to see Aya Fumino. Please tell me where she is. What's the matter? Four Eyes looks tense again. Don't call him Four Eyes. It's real rude. I didn't have a classmate named Aya Fumino. I, you can't say that now. But I really didn't. So who wrote this letter then? I don't know. Here's your letter though. Tanaka hands the letter back to me. Tanaka put his wig back on. I gave you honest answers. Why the fuck do we have to go through all that just for that then? You son of a bitch. <laughs> you gave me useless answers. Punch his face. <laughs> you wouldn't let a guy with glasses, would you? Yes. Yes, I fucking would. <laughs> After you mess me around like that, I'll bring you proof. Wait here. Tanaka goes back into the office. This is so weird. He completely opened up. But he claims again when it comes to Aya. He claims up again when it comes to Aya, sorry. What, what's going on? Tanaka comes back. This is private information. I'm not supposed to show you, but I guess I don't have a choice. What could prove that Aya Fumino doesn't exist? It's a list of all the students who were attending Matsue Oba High School 15 years ago. I look at the paper Tanaka handed me. It's in the order of the Japanese alphabet. For the girls, it starts with Fuyu Abe. Fuyumi Abe, sorry. Number two is Kana Igarashi. Number three is Ryo Ueno. Right, it's in order of the Japanese alphabet. Aya Fumino would be in between number 18, Ri Riko Haneda, and number 19, Miho Honma. But she's not there. If this list is accurate, there was no Aya Fumino in that class. Can I have this? Of course not. You may not take a picture or make a copy either. Can I take a closer look? Tanaka takes the list away from me. This is real. You see my name here too? I can indeed see Kosuke Tanaka. I'm not lying. Now you know. What is going on here? Who was sending me those letters? Then who was the girl that I knew? I don't know. Tanaka's reaction isn't good. Picture. Then who's this in the picture? I show Aya's picture to Tanaka. I... I don't know. Something's fishy. Could it be that Aya Fumino you're looking for is this woman in the obituaries? Tanaka shows me a copy of the newspaper story. What's this? It's an obituaries page. It says Aya Fumino, 18 years old, died of disease. That's not very specific, but okay. It's a newspaper from 25 years ago. Aya Fumino was a high school student who fell ill and died. You know about that, right? I heard about her, but she's not the one I'm looking for. I bet someone was tricking you. You should stop looking for a woman who doesn't exist. That's my own business. You know about the person who wrote this letter. Tell me the truth. I really don't, and I really need to get back to work, so who were you tutoring then? Wait, can you show me the student list? Did he admit that he gave his golden cat charm to Aya Fumino? Can you show me the student list again? Tanaka hands me the list. If I can't make a copy, I'll transcribe it. I started writing the names on the list in the blank space of a guidebook. Number one, Fuyumi Abe. Number two, Kana Igarashi. Number three, Ryo Ueno. What are you doing? Hey, you're transcribing. Skip to number 18, Riku, <laughs> Riku Haneda. Number 19, Miho Honma. I managed to write number one, Fuyumi Abe. Number two, yeah, I know. Give me back that list. Looks like I have to give it back. Please leave now. I don't think he'll talk to me anymore. Here's the golden cat charm. You can have it. I give Tanaka the golden cat charm and leave the city office. Transcribed list of names, which we got four names out of. I found four eyes from Aya's letter, but I didn't get any closer to finding Aya. Aya, now what? One of the people in the list? We should go hit them up. Obviously they would have known her if she was there. Banana stationery? <laughs> My favourite stationery. No. Does Aya really not exist? 
Who was I corresponding with? Now I'm getting hungry. I think I, I think better on a full stomach anyway. No, no, not ask. Idiot. Let's go back to our um, our great food place. Kami Arien. That's it. I arrive at Kami Arien. Sanpei comes over. Welcome. Oh, it's you from the other day. The Yamata no Orochi Sobo was great, so I came back. What'll it be today? I look over the menu. They have all kinds of soba dishes and combo meals. And it all looks good. There's so many choices, it's hard to decide. How about the speed eating challenge? See how many bowls of Yamata no Orochi Sobo you can eat in 30 minutes. The record's five bowls. No way, who the hell could eat that much? No one's beat his record for 15 years. What do you get if you set a new record? The food is free. So what do you say? Uh, no thanks. What are today's specials? Everything, of course. What did I have yesterday for lunch? Yesterday was the Shinjimi bowl. Alright, that's it. I'll have a Shinjimi bowl again. Yes sir, one Shinjimi bowl. Sunpei heads to the kitchen. Alright, I guess I'll wait until the food comes. Chick. Chickaroo. It's the regular menu. Everything looks delicious. Oh, what was that? The table is super shiny. I can almost see my own reflection. The TV is on, but the show doesn't look that interesting. Who's that? I look around the shop. There's a label on the, the picture that says Masaya Watanabe, Matsue Oba High School, speed eating, re speed eating record, Yamada no Orochi Soba, five bowls. So that's the record holder. Hey, isn't he the coach of the baseball team? I should take a picture. I take a picture of Watanabe's speed eating record. Here you go. Sanpei brings over a Shinjimi bowl. It has plenty of plump, sh plump shimjimi clams on top. The rice is infused with their flavour and it looks and smells fantastic. Thanks. I let myself get lost in the shinjimi, shinjimi bowl's flavour. It was so good I finished before I knew it. Genkichi comes over from the kitchen. How was it man? It was the best. The shinjimi clams must love being part of something so good. You're a funny guy. <laughs> Thanks. Alright, let's get this uh, investigation back on track, shall we? By the way, have you ever heard a rumour that the empty lot is haunted? That ain't a rumour. That's the truth. Me and Sanpei saw a ghost a bunch of times. So, was it a female ghost? High school age? Nope. Well, it was a girl, but in her late 20s. How do you know she's in her late 20s? I've got an eye for that kind of thing. <laughs> Creepy. Oh, give me a break. Sanpei belongs... blogs about ghost sightings. Okay. Did the rumours originate from that blog? Nope, they really do appear there. Ghosts, huh? By the way, I forgot to give you one of these. Ginkichi hands over a Sumo Ashikoshi Stamp Rally card. This is the rewards card for the Sumo Ashikoshi Stamp Rally. What is that? Stamp Rally card. You mentioned that before, what the heck is it? It's what we call the Seven Delicacies of Lake Shinji, a specialty of Lake Shinji. The Su in Sumo okay, uh, Ashikoshi is for Suzuki, sea bass. The Mo is for Moroge Ebi, prawn. The Yu is for Unagi, eel. The A is from As Ama Amasagi, smelt. The Shi is for Shira Uo, whitebait. The Ko is for Koi carp. And the other Shi is for Shinjimi clams. I ate Unagi in the Yamata no Orochi Soba, and I ate the Shinjimi bowl today, so. That's why you stamped U and she? Yep. What happens when you get all the stamps? Gotta get them all to find out. Gotta catch them all. Making a big deal out of it, huh? How's the investigation going? One step forward, two steps back? What? You haven't gotten anywhere? That's the two steps back. Pretty much, yeah. <laughs> I 
Is there a store in Matsue which has been around for a while where high schoolers, high school students like to gather? The convenience store maybe? No, I don't think that'll work. It needs to be a store where the students and staff would recognize each other. You should hit up Marukoshi. What kind of place is it? They have food for cheap. Was it mentioned in the guidebook? Let's have a look. I consult the guidebook. Here it is. Someone here might know the students from Oba High School 15 years ago. Young man, half price for today too. Hey, are you sure? You heard me. Half price for this guy. The shop has great service. Fucking A hey, doesn't want. I need here every day. <laughs> now that I'm full, I guess I'll check out that Marukoshi place. Let's roll. If I was going to get half price food every day, I'd never fucking leave. <laughs> I arrive at Marukoshi. There are some high school students hanging out and chatting about nothing in particular. So this is Marukoshi. And it's set up like a bento shop. I wonder what they have. Water, apparently. Going to the sign. They're selling shaved ice right now. I haven't had that in a while. I want some. I look at the vending machine. Cans of juice and coffee are less than 100 yen each. There's even juice for 50 yen. This is the ultimate vending machine. I'm taking it home. There's a menu on the wall. Takoyaki, 250 yen. Soba omelet, 200 yen. Fried dough, 50 yen each. Croquette, 50 yen. No wonder they get a lot of students here. Hey, good prices. When I enter the shop, a few high school boys and girls are chatting happily. Should I talk to them? There's a water cooler. The inside of the shop is like a little cram school. I get some water and buy a piece of fried kanako dough and sit at a table. I haven't had fried dough in a while. My gaze drifts to the group of high school students chatting happily. I wonder if Aya and her friends came here. Aya and her seven classmates are having a good time. I killed someone. I must atone for my sins. This is farewell. Goodbye. I let myself get lost in thought and when I look up I realise that the students have left. I'm the only customer in the place. Maybe the person I had killed was a classmate. It would explain why four eyes didn't want to talk about her. But if that's the case, who did she kill? I have more of your letters. I take out a piece of banana pattern stationery from my bag. I let myself get lost in thought and when I look up I realise that the students have left. I'm the only customer- You said that a minute ago. Am I having fucking deja vu or... Am I tripping balls? There might be a hint to solve the mystery in here. I'll read it over. Dear Max, the rainy season is over and it's been humid every day here in Matsue. How are things over there? Let me tell you about my classmate Monkey. He's the pillar of the baseball team. He played a huge part in the finals of the prefectural tournament. But they lost the they lost the game, but it was fun cheering for them from the bleachers. He's a bit ill-tempered, but he's a kind person at heart. I might have done something bad to him, but it was it was for his own good. Someday I'll understand. Someday, I believe that. Monkey is good at baseball, but I think he also has leadership skills to become a coach. In the future, he might lead our alma ma alma mater to nationals. I have a feeling. Wait, is that the coach? Like the coach is this monkey? The one who's the eating champion? Shimane has a lot of stories about monsters. Some monsters are cute, but I can't handle the creepy ones. I have Fumino. P.S. What kind of adult do you want to become, Max? The kind that traipses halfway across the country looking for someone who may not exist, apparently. What did I write back to him? Thanks for your letter. Tokyo is crazy hot right now. Why wow, your school's baseball team went all the way to prefectural finals, huh? Must have been fun, I'm jealous. My whole school went up against my favorite winners in the first round and lost. It was a it was a cooled game, but our team has taken it well at least. They were talking big about winning the Tokyo how winning the Tokyo finals is harder than winning the nationals. They played soccer in middle school, but I gave it up. There are people in the world who got talent for no amount of hard work we can make up for sports. Oh fucking hell. Every time. I want to have ideals. My ideal adult is rich. My ad ideal adult is someone who has dreams. Let's go with that one. You always need to be focused on something. Do you want to be an adult soon? 
What do you think of selfish adults? Do you like rich people? What kind of adult do you want to become? Let's go with that. I got pretty serious in that letter. The lady who runs, Marukoshi, comes over. Excuse me, is something the matter? What? You were muttering to yourself. Oh, I just have a lot on my mind is all. I see. Hey, has this shop been around for a while? Oh yes, for over 20 years. Then you must be familiar with the high school students in this area. Sure am. This here's a hangout for high school kids. Hmm, she might actually know something. Let's ask. What kind of high school students come to this place? We get lots of hungry young lads. They stop by on the way home from school. Oh right, the other day the coach came by with the whole team. A celebration for winning the game, he said. That sounds... sweaty. <laughs> you B.O. Lovely. I want to hear more about Aya, not this guy. Should I show you the picture? This is a photo from 15 years ago, but do you recognize her? I show the lady Aya's photo. Well, she's a Matsui Oba High School student. Do you recognize her though? I'm sorry, I don't. Oh, okay. Another dead end. I'm getting discouraged. Is this girl your daughter? No, she was my pen pal from 15 years ago. 15 years ago, huh? That year was... Yes. The year that my cousin got married. Well, that had nothing to do with Aya. Was there an incident that year? What sort of incident? Like, an incident where a high school student was arrested for murder. Nothing like that around here. What about the attempted murder? Where, what about attempted murder? Were there any incidents where a girl in high school was arrested? Never had anything crazy like that around here. No one knows. This could be something big. What are you looking into? I'm just looking for my pen pal. Do you know anyone who might have a lot of information about the Matsui area? The man you're looking for is the captain of the tour boat, Yes, S. Swan. That fella is well acquainted with high school students. <laughs> oh my god, that sounds creepy, the way you just said that. How acquainted. <laughs> Thanks. I'll have to go see him. It's still kind of unclear, but oh well. I'll try the tour boat boarding area. Check the guidebook. A family owned eatery. They serve delicious aged pan takoyaki, ubanyaki, and more at low prices. Making it popular among local high school students. Let's roll. Thanks, lady. I'm out of here. There are 20 or so passengers lined up at the boarding area. The SS Swan is long, a long flat tour boat. There's a painting of Shimaneko on his white hull. I wonder who the captain is. When I notice a man with a white beard wearing a captain's hat. Yeah, that guy. He just needs a shirt that says, I'm the captain. Excuse me, you must be the captain. Yep, sure am. What can I do for you? I heard you know a lot about Matsue. Could I ask you a few questions? I wanted to ask you about Matsue Oba High School. Matsue Oba High School? Are you a fan too? Fan? What are you talking about? Oh, guess not. Well, now he seems disappointed. <laughs> well, we shouldn't have said that then, should we? It's time to set sail. We'll talk on the ship. The captain boards the SS Swan. The SS Swan is a tour boat that operates on Lake Shinji. If I get on, I won't be able to come back for at least an hour. Well, I do want to hear what the captain has to say. I board the SS Swan. There are chairs set up on the rear deck and several passengers are sitting down. There are tatami mats lining the inside rooms. Yeah, like It's like a houseboat. The captain is seated up front at the helm and is preparing to set sail. Doesn't look like a good time to chat. Once the SS Swan sets sail, an audio guide for the Lake Shinji, for Lake, the Lake Shinji cruise starts to play. Captain, got a little time to talk? I don't chit chat while at sea, on principle. He just said we'll have to talk on the boat. Now you're saying you don't talk on the boat? Well, which one is it, son? <laughs> Didn't he say we could talk on the ship? Come back later. Well then, I better leave a be for now. If you're taking a trip, enjoy it. I'll enjoy it when you answer my questions. Guess I'll just have to wait until this little cruise is over with. The boat glides along the across the lake's tranquil surface at a leisurely pace. Unlike oceans or rivers, lake cruises sure are peaceful. You can relax, enjoy the scenery. It's actually pretty nice. 
Check. It's a TV. There's nothing interesting on it, though. I mean, we're meant to be looking at the ocean, right? What's the point of coming out on a ship and to watch the fucking TV? <laughs> They've got brochures for the Lake Shinji Cruise. I guess I'll take one. I read through the Lake Shinji Cruise brochure. The sunset at Lake Shinji is so beautiful it has been named one of Japan's top 100. The sunset cruise lets you fully enjoy the beautiful lake as it's dyed gold. It looks like we're going to be on the water for a while. It sounds like it. Until sunset. I can see the scenery outside through the window. It's very beautiful. It sure is. It's a regular table. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks for that. It's a regular table. <laughs> I guess I'm done chick chick chicken. What else can we do? Guidebook? A superb view of the sunset, yeah. Think? Swaying on the waves with my eyes closed is making me sleepy. Should I go to sleep? Is there somewhere to sleep in here? I don't think I can sleep just here. There's no one to talk to, right? Yeah, that's what I thought. Swaying on the waves with my eyes closed is making me sleepy. Don't open your eyes then, stupid. Inventory? Don't need anything right now? Oh my god, what do you want then? Oh, something happened. Shit. The TV on the boat is showing a commercial for Lake Shinji. Shinjimi clams. Looks like a local commercial. A little girl about seven years old is advertising Shinjimi. Shinjimi clams are apparently a local specialty of Lake Shinji. Look at her, she's adorable. Arisa Sasaki, right? She'll be a famous actress someday, for sure. Her mother was a celebrity too. Oh, really? Seems like she's a famous child actress in Matsue. On the back page of the Lake Shinji cruise brochure is a photo of Aris Arisa and an advertisement that says Usagi Theatrical Company now recruiting. The boat returns to the dock after 45 minute trips around Lake Sh 45 minute trip around Lake Shinji. The SS Swan returns to the dock. I jump off the boat. Is there any point to riding around the lake? How was the cruise? It was pretty relaxing, but I didn't get a chance to talk to you. That's all as it should be. It takes a little time for people to become acquainted. Just by being in the same space, you can learn about their personality. I guess so. You had something you wanted to ask me, and when I asked you to wait, you did. I didn't have a choice, but that alone tells me your character. Less like my character and more like your aura. You were giving off a major don't talk to me vibe. You're a funny guy. <laughs> the captain laughs heartily. Gonna laugh it off, huh? Seems the right to ask about Aya now. Let's do it. Do you know of a girl named Aya Fumino? Is she one of those pop stars or something? No, nothing like that, but it might be faster to just show them the photo. Can do. I'll jump right in. Do you recognize this girl? I show Aya's photo to the captain. This is from 15 years ago, but... Sorry, but I don't think I can help you. Young girls all look the same when you get old. I heard you're well acquainted with Matsue's high school students. Someone told you wrong. I don't know the students, but I know all about the baseball teams. I'm a big fan and watch every Shimane Prefecture final. There's a big difference between high school students and high school baseball. Do you remember the summer tournament 15 years ago? It was Matsue Oba High School and Hamanakawa High School in the finals. I'll never forget that game. That good of a game? Well, it wound up being a 7-1 win for Hamanakawa. Oba's ace player was off his game. What part of that was an unforgettable game? It was the first time I caught a home run ball. And that's it? I even got it autographed to commemorate the occasion. Is a ball with a high school student's autograph worth anything? It is to me. By the way, Oba High School might finally make the Nationals for the first time this year. Have they got a good player now or something? They've got a pitcher and a clean-up hitter named Ichitaro Matsui. And even the recruiters for the pros are interested in him. A pitcher and a clean-up hitter. 
That's the best of both worlds. They got a player like that, huh? I'd love to get his autograph. I have some things I want to ask about the baseball team at the Opa High School. Oh ho, so you've become interested. This year's team is spectacular. It's not just Matsui either. The whole team is just as good. This will be the year the coach realizes his dream. The captain's so excited I don't want to interrupt, even though it's irrelevant to my investigation. It might not be. Was there a player like a monkey in Oba's baseball team 15 years ago? Not that I remember. Hmm. Oh, I remember the year before that, Oba High School had a scandal and couldn't enter the tournament. What kind of scandal? A second year got in a fight with a student from another school 16 years ago. Oba had a good third year player, so if they'd been able to enter, they could have made it to nationals. So they directed all that frustration into winning the following year, huh? They made it to the finals, but their ace destroyed his right arm in the process. Brian shame. I've learned a lot about the baseball team from back then, but I still don't know who Monkey is. No use asking any more questions. Thank you. Maybe we can chat again sometime. Sure. The captain walks away. I should think about what to do next, alright. I'm gonna go to the school. Kind of think of it, I's letter said that Oba High School got to the finals in the high school baseball tournament. Monkey must have been on the team. Where would I go for newspapers? Oh, the library. Okay. To the library, shall we? Matsui Central Library, there you go. If I look up the high school baseball records from 15 years ago, I might find something that'll lead me to Monkey. He's obviously the coach guy who was yelling at us before. I'm in the periodical section. The high school baseball prefectural tournament finals are in late July. I should look for the July newspapers from 15 years ago. I find a newspaper article. There's an article in the morning edition from July 26th in the finals. Hamadakawa High School won against Oba High School. In her letter, Aya said that Monkey played a huge part. The article lists the players' scores. From Oba High School, the four players seem to have done... So four players seem to have done well. Three for four and one home run, it says. The player's name was... What? I let out a cry of amazement which draws glares from all around. It's Watanabe. Duh. From all around. Sorry. I apologize in a soft voice and they look away. The player's name is Watanabe. Same as the gorilla-like teacher who caught me. You think? He must be monkey. But this isn't enough to be sure he's monkey. I reread the article. The only one who hit a home run in the finals was Watsonabe. A home run? There's something about that. Is there? Can I go? Think? The captain was saying he got the home run ball autographed. The ball should have the player's name. The newspaper also has a picture of the moment when Hanum, Hanum, Hamunakawa High School won. The overjoyed Hamunakawa players are in the foreground, with the so sobbing Oba High School players behind them. <laughs> The broad back then looks like his. I made a copy of the newspaper article. I'd better go see the captain. Can do. I feel like we're just darting around the place. We're all over the place, man. I don't see the captain anywhere. Bad timing, I guess. I checked the timetable in the waiting room, but there's still about an hour until the next departure. He might not be back for a while. I'd hoped he'd show me his signed ball. <laughs> I was hoping the captain would show me his balls. Oh well. Just waiting around is kind of boring. What should I do? Get food. More food. I should think about where I can't, damn it. I suppose I'll go meet Monkey. He'll be a month away over high school. I hope he'll meet with me. He didn't seem to like us very much. He thought we were a creep. Maybe we are. I'm not sure. I'm back at Oba High School. The students are preparing to head home. I'm just in time, school's getting out. I'll go to the field to see if the baseball team's there. As I arrived at the field, I can see a bunch of people there already. It's the baseball team practicing. How can this get... Just off and on a tangent here for a second. If this game is a remastered version of a game that already existed in the original version, how is there still spelling and grammar, grammatical errors? Anyway, <laughs> I'm watching them practice for a while. There's no sign of them. A baseball team member passes by. Hey, do you know where the coach is? You're the one who was with the coach the day before yesterday, right? Uh, yeah, I'm an acquaintance of his. Coach wasn't feeling well, so he went home for the day. 
shit. And could you tell me his nickname? The only thing we really call him is Coach. We all respect him. They trust him more than I thought. It's thanks to Coach that I've been able to keep playing baseball. What do you mean? There was a time I almost became a delinquent, but Coach risked his life to stop me. You can't judge a book by its ape-like ape -like cover. That's mean. Coach teaches us how to be people, rather than about baseball. He tells us to become first-class first, rate, first -class people before pe becoming first-class baseball players. I sure can't argue with that. Other baseball team members come over. Matsui, what's going on? Who's the old man? Old man? I'm a young guy, no matter how you slice it. He knows the coach. Don't be rude. He's a mature one, so this is the Matsui who got the best of both worlds. Matsui, you're the ace and the cleanup hitter, right? Yeah, you sure know a lot. I heard from coach. Oh, okay. Great, I lied again. If I stick around too long, I'll end up lying a lot more. Your coach used to be on the team when he was in high school, right? Yeah, they were the runners at the prefectural runners up at the prefectural tournament 15 years ago. That was the only year Oba High School made it to the finals. I heard he hit a home run at the finals and played a huge part. He doesn't like to talk about it though. That's because. Matsui's brisk speech suddenly falters. Matsui, do you know something? Coach was originally a pitcher. He was a starter at the finals too, but he lost a lot of points in the opening round and was sent to the outfield. He was a pitcher, huh? I wonder who's better, you right now or the coach of the past? Coach, for sure. He went to the finals after all. I have a long way to go. We're still in the middle of the preliminaries for the prefectural tournament. One day, if I win the finals and make it to the nationals, then I'll be able to hold my head high and say I surpassed coach. Good luck, I'm sure he's waiting for that day. Can we do that one? I was under the impression that he was a fielder. Coach was the one who went to the finals last time, 15 years ago, but he lost 5 points in the opening round and was traded to the outfield. So he had the best of both too. Isn't that funny? What is? I've never seen Coach pitch. Oh, he hurt his right arm and he had to give up his pitching career. Broken arm, yeah. That guy's got quite a past. You're an acquaintance of coaches, right? Uh, yeah, sort of. I am. I'm worried about him. Yeah, me too. The other players nod in agreement. Wonder what it could be. Yeah, it's like something bothering him. Something's bothering him. Is something the matter? Now, a few times we've seen him in an empty, an empty classroom, deep in thought. Yesterday he was even drinking alcohol. I heard he likes a banana flavoured cocktail called a monkey mix. A banana flavoured cocktail? Is he trying to be a monkey? Well, grown ups need a drink once in a while. But the coach said he'd abstain until we make it to nationals. But he gave in, huh? There's got to be a reason. Please help him. Well, this is getting weird. I mean, sure. Hey, listen, Matsui. Yeah? Do you think I could get a sign, bo sign ball? Yes, I'd be happy to, but in exchange, please look out for coach. Matsui signed a ball and gave it to me. This might become uh, my treasured possession, like the captain. You mean we'll give it to the captain in exchange for something else? I've played a point and click adventure game, I know what's up. Let's see, what should I do now? I want to find out more about Monkey. Think. If Watanabe is Monkey, then he and Four Eyes were classmates. I'll try asking Four Eyes. Oh yeah, because he's he really enjoys talking to us. He really likes us. Anyway, we're going to wrap this one up here because we're out of time for today. But even though we're running all over town and we're getting to know a lot of people, I really don't feel like we're any closer to Aya at all. I mean, I'm sure we're getting somewhere. It just doesn't feel like it. And it feels weird to be railroaded. Like, I don't know, there's something weird about it because, like, it feels like you're forced to go in a specific direction and like it's it's official novel so that's normal right so it shouldn't feel bad but having all these menus which i really like makes it feel like it's a lot more open-ended than it actually is it feels like it should be open to just mess around but it's not you just have to click the right button at the right time you know what i mean I, i'm still enjoying it though very cool i hope the i hope the uh, payoff for the story is is worth it anyway maybe we'll find out next time Thanks for watching Bruce and I'll see you then.